21-0 blowout. First down, Prescott. Oh, it's a screen pass. That's complete. Oh, he's got Woo. a little daylight. Woo. Ezekiel Elliott. Zeke did he dirty. Zeke did he dirty. Zeke did he dirty. Stop his heat. Stop doing them like that. Ezekiel Elliott, 75 yards. And they are able to strike first here on their opening drive. Wow, first play of the game, CD, 75 too yards. Easy, These too people easy. They haven't even filed in yet from the tailgate lots. Everyone talks about starting out fast. Everyone talks about getting explosive type plays. That was absolutely a thunderbolt. And on the defensive side, he spent all week <laughs> scheming. It's going to be an easy game. Preparing, and it seems like it goes right out the window. This field at Make the your two. fumble, make your fumble. Oh. Turn here, he gets it out to the 25 yard line. What should we do? Let's run this. Just don't throw the ball, you'll be all right. <laughs> Darnold and Bell lay fixing this shit. First and ten at their own 25-yard line. Darnold down to throw. Got his man, Robbie Anderson. And he's taken down, but able to slip across run the 35. It. There you go, run it nice again. Nice way to start the drive, a gain of 12 and a first down. Now, Charles, what's the mindset here offensively? You gave up the touchdown pretty quickly. Would it have changed if you had gotten a stop and it would be 0 0 right now or no? I wouldn't think so. I think in most cases, just down a touchdown, you know, I mean, we're just getting started here. It should be a long way to go. You think to yourself, stick with the game plan, all the things you worked on in practice. But you have some teams that when they get down, their natural tendency is to aggressively score. Uh uh. And let's see if they want to get outside of the game plan we expect and try and be aggressive on their first series. Now the first carry for Le'Veon Bell. Boy, no chance as he was met and dropped behind the line there. That'll back him be up smart, punt the ball. Just be fourth. smart. Nice play right there to stop him behind the line, but I want to see how this defense continues to play him here in the first half. Yeah, we know. You know better than I. He has the ability to take over a game. So what do you do? Yeah, I think you have to make sure that you bottle him in at varying levels because if you crowd everyone to the line of scrimmage if he breaks through it's nothing but room to run oh. nearly a huge return as it is still a very good one 24 yards and the cowboys will take over the football with a first and 10. No, sir. The offense now at the line, ready for their next drive. And last time, the formula was pretty simple. One play drive, one pass. Uh, maybe they just want to do that again, right? And that's exactly how you want to draw things up, whether it's on your grease board, right, in your playbook. One play drive is exactly what you want on offense. What they have to be careful of is not having a letdown. It was fairly easy last time. They can't expect that going forward. And we'll see if it's that easy here. On second down, Elliott. Uh, and this time he's not going anywhere. They'll get him down right at the line of scrimmage. Big winner Williams there on the stop. They'll try and run for with Elliott. And he's going to get to the big guy one and hey. for the first down. Yeah, that one was relatively easy to see. I noticed that from up here. Yeah, it doesn't take a whole lot, does it? Sometimes you get multiples. What I always love on these offsides is when each side points at the other. Hey, you did it. No, you did it. They deciphered that one correctly. Good work that time to get him to jump. And now here's first and ten. Prescott. It's a gain of seven, and that'll bring up second down. Able to get seven on that first down pass play. Second and three. Heavy rush and down he goes. Quinnen Williams gets him for a loss of eight. What great push up front. On third down, it's Prescott. Now they set up the screen. That's complete. Zeke with a shake and bake. So easy. yards, good for a Cowboy first down. Let's give a little credit there. The offensive play caller sends that the screen pass Too was easy. available. Whenever you're getting a lot of heavy pressure towards your quarterback, that's when you're thinking about running the screen and using that pressure against the defense. And it worked very well there for a first down. 
Couple of first downs to kick off the drive. Here's first and 10 up at the 46. Off play action to Elliott. Here's Prescott. Wide open. Run that bad. Run that bad. Run that bad. Not bad. Six overall pick got the sack that time. They play fake to Elliott. Now Prescott. Told you. Wide open. open. Michael Gallup. And he is into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Michael Gallup, 66 yards. And the Cowboys, they push out in front further. As a former DB, you might not like to see that, but from a wide receiver's perspective, those are the plays they dream of. Correct on both counts, all right? Because once he took off, I mean, let's face it, that should have been done in big sky country. Aren't any speed limits out there? And off he went. Glad I wasn't the one trying to chase him. Following the touchdown, here's Marr to kick it away. This will be taken in at the Make you fumble, make you fumble. Come on, and man. He'll get across the 20 before he's brought down at about the 23-yard line. Jets offense coming up now to start their next drive. They've been outplayed early, no question. Down 14 nothing already as they come up first and 10. Give me that. Come on, man. There's a pass on first down that's knocked away and incomplete. The veteran safety, George Iloka, there to break that one up. It's always a battle. Who's going to win on first down? The offense or the defense? Let's face it. If you've got the ball, four yards or more on first down is what you're aiming for. They tried to throw for it there. Nice effort to knock that one away and bring up second down. On second and ten, Darnold is brought in by Jamison Crowder. And he takes this up to the 40-yard line before being corralled. It's a pickup of 17 and a first down. Darnold from the gun. This one caught by Crowder. And he'll be taken down as that will take us to the uh, end of the first quarter of play. Let's do this. 14-0 the score. This is the NFL on EA Sports. So from Cowboy territory now, here's first and 10. At the 41. To the air again, Donald. Nuh -uh. He's got a catch the right side. They get 10 more there, and I believe that'll be enough for another first down at will. On first down, Darnold. Eluding the pressure right. Fumble, fumble. And he'll uh. avoid the tackle there with a slide. And wind up getting nine after tucking it and running, so it'll leave him with second and a yard. They brought the blitz that time, and I thought they were going to get to him, but instead, he flipped it on its ear and ended up picking up positive yardage. I thought he was dead to rights, but you are exactly correct, sir. Able to turn that into a positive game. Here's Bell. And he'll get it down this time in the 17. Four yards the pickup, first down. First red zone opportunity now for the Jets. They've got a first and 10 at the 17. And they'll keep it on the ground with Bell. Oh, I had him. Bell first down to Benson. And he's in. Touchdown, Jets. From 17 yards out. As they are now on the board here in the first half. And they're able to run it in. It started with the battle in the trenches. They won there. And they got in for six points. And that's all right. I'm going to score right back. To deal with. They've got to go to the bench now and figure out. How are we going to slow down this running game? Because on that particular play, he they had no answer. This is fielded at the goal line. And it's a pretty good return here as he'll get it up to the 29-yard line. Let's see. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. And right now they're saying, hey, let's keep this going. Two drives, two touchdowns. Yeah, can't ask for a better start than that, can you? I mean, this is the way you practice it. This is the way you rehearse it. But right now, the play calling, they're locked in really well. That's a strong safety making a strong, hard tackle. And we know his coach. Doesn't smile a whole lot, does he? How about that grin right there? Ear to ear after that play. 
Come on, Whitney. They try to throw on second down, but this one is incomplete. Even without a ton of pressure in his face, it just shows how difficult it is to pick apart his own defense. Those guys are sitting back, and they're not playing receivers as much as they're playing the eyes of the quarterback and when he delivers the ball. First down, first down. They had the incomplete pass on second down. Now they need a big play here, third and ten. To throw is Prescott. Going to take a shot for Gallup. And it's knocked away and incomplete. The secondary has been roasted in this first half, but they get a measure of revenge there. Nice play on the deep ball. Yeah, they're going to need a few more plays like that in order to get their confidence fully back, but that's one step in the proper direction. Oh, I get mine. Dak and the offense still out there. They are going to go for it. They're indeed going for it. It's Prescott. I get mine. Lead that. To Jason Witten. And they're going to have this across midfield and inside the 45. Hey, nothing to see here. Just your standard fourth down gain of 28 yards. And the drive keeps going. Here's Elliott. Solid running on the carry, but still brought down just inside of the 40. He'll get a nice chunk there on the first down run, and it's second and four. A reminder, coming up at halftime, Jonathan Coachman will join us from Orlando with our halftime report. The business to take care of before we get there. A two-minute drill before the coaches' two-minute drill. Now, meanwhile, here's a second down throw that's knocked away and incomplete. Randall Cobb, the intended receiver, and it's third and four. Here's Prescott. They'll set up the screen to Elliott. And he picks up the first before he's taken down at the 29. Eight yards, first down as they're able to convert. As an unbiased observer, I think it would have been interesting to see what they would have done if they hadn't gotten the first down there. But since they did, I guess the point is moved. And they're right there in that middle ground. Field goal Come range, on. punt, go for it. But as you said, they picked it up. They have a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. So this will be accepted as it moves the offense backwards. So now second and ten after the incompletion on first down. After the penalty, it's Elliott. The linebacker, C.J. Mosley, in on the stop. One thing to keep in mind, partner, especially in the second half, when you've got a running back of this size and these dimensions, I can just tell you, attrition does set in for a defense because you're excited about hitting him in the first half. Maybe not so much in the second half. And some of these shorter games turn into bigger pressure from his right, and he goes down hard, flat on his back. And the offense not going anywhere. They're staying out there. They've converted once already on this drive. Here they go again on fourth down. And he's not able to get away. He is stopped well, well short of a first down. Jason Garrett might be wanting to reconsider the decision to go for it there. And the Jets are going to get the football back. On first and ten, Donald. On the catch, it's Crowder. The Jets are going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with a little over 30 seconds to go in the first half of play. One play has him up past the 40 already and another first and 10. To throw his door. Give me that. He's going to float this one deep right side. And that is incomplete. Showed off the arm strength there, but to no avail. Second down. Those passes out that far wide always make you hold your breath a little bit. Felt like it was in the air for a while. What it does is it allows a defender to gain some ground, come from a long distance, and have a chance to affect the pass. No, that's mine. Oh, come on. Deep ball there on second down, but it'll wind up incomplete. One thing I know from experience is that when the deep ball is thrown and you're the defender, You've got to fight that little bit of panic that emerges. You've got to play the ball really well. It's a 50-50 jump ball play. And guess what? They took a shot. How are you going to win it? And in this case, they managed to get it done. 
Now yet another incompletion here as they fail to connect on third. Here's Lachlan Edwards now. As he'll kick it away for the second time. All right, let's score a touchdown before half. That's what we're going to do. Touchdown. Da -da -da -da. The offense back out there at the line, ready for their next drive. Time for a final kneel down or a safe run, and then they can head to the locker room with a lead. Yeah, or they can even run a screen. You know, something that gets somewhat safe that might actually pop and turn into a big play, that's what you usually run in this situation. Or go four verticals because why not? Because you're feeling it, right? You're just feeling it. Try to get one more in here before the quarter breaks. Final play of the half. Prescott going to take a shot for Gallup. And that will be incomplete. Tried to dial up the long one way out there, but it'll be third down. So we have reached halftime with a touchdown. That's the difference on the scoreboard. As we are off to Orlando now to check in with Jonathan Coachman and our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach, the Cowboys will get the football first here, and they have the lead as well as we are underway in quarter three. And he'll take this across the 25, a couple extra yards, up to the 27-yard line. The offense now at the line, ready for their next drive. They're close, close game, but they're going to need to do a little bit better probably here in half two, no? I would agree with that totally. I would guess it in the locker room. They talked about cleaning up some of the errors, but overall, I think they wanted to be positive with them. Guys, we're right there. Just not playing as well as we need to. Let's pick it up. And we still have a chance to win this game. Yeah, they they ain't got a chance to do it. So here's a first and ten at the 38. They'll run it with Bell. And this will be good for a pickup of nine to the 46. Despite the blitz, they're still able to pick up a nice solid game. The disadvantage of blitzing often alters the normal spacing and run fits and leaves creases like they were. No, you're good, you're good. Exploit right there. 
No, you're good. You're good. Oh, yeah, I know. That's last run got nine. That leaves him with second and a yard. Now Bell. And he'll take it down shy of the 45 at the 46. That one, a first down pickup of eight. Boy, he does it at a high level, doesn't he? Because when I watch him, I think of his vision. Straight ahead, peripheral. Also has that sense of where holes are going to be before they actually open. I think that helps set him apart from many of the other bats in the league. Now a first down carry by Bell. George Iloka, the one that comes up to make the tackle. And he'll try the air now with Darnold. This is Anderson over the middle. And they'll be inside the 35 now at the 34-yard line. That one, a first down pickup of eight. This has to go down as one of the simpler routes in the playbook, but oh so effective. Nice completion there. Keeps the sticks moving. Hey, switch gears, switch gears. My 55, my 55. They'll run on first down. It's Bell. Demarcus Lawrence in on the tackle. Well, we saw him there trying to get it to the outside, trying to get to the perimeter, but not a whole lot of room there. But there's got to be one positive to that. If you keep moving laterally, creases tend to develop as the game moves on, and they can run it back inside later. The run only got a yard. Here's second and nine. The shotgun snap for Donald. And that's going to be incomplete. Too tough to hold on to that one. It's second down. We have not seen a whole lot of wide open receivers. Everything seemingly has been contested. And that's another nice You're job good. You're good. Go take your time. They've been very cohesive, knowing each other's moves all game long. And they've been on the spot just about every time. Here, I'll pause it for you. Check on the scoreboard. And take it. Down. Shit, you ready? I can't pause it. And now a timeout called by the Cowboys defense. It's just their... Two remaining as they burn one here. No, in no this problem. Third quarter. Hey, I used to, I had a party train. I'm about to start. Right. Right Mike, 54 Mike. Check, check. Watch 54. Watch 54. You must get The shotgun. Here's Donald. To the end zone, but it's incomplete. He was looking for Jamison Crowder there. And that'll bring up second down. Just a little beyond the reach there of his receiver. That's probably one he wishes he had back. He wishes it had been seven on seven in practice, or maybe even routes versus air, because that's a completion he makes, what, 9.9 .9 times out of 10? Just missed that one. On second down, it's Bell. 
So a nice job to break the one tackle, but not much daylight after that as he's brought down. Give him four on the ground there. They're now left with third and six. Darnold off the play fake to Bell. Oh. Grand. Touchdown, Jets. Quincy Anunwa there to make the grab as they are an extra point away now from tying this football game. Extra point right down the middle, and we are tied at 14. What's wrong? You want me to give him a bath? Nothing separating these two teams on the scoreboard as the kick's away here. This will be taken to the back of the end zone. And he'll wind up about four yards shy of where he would have been if he had taken a knee as they'll start at the 21-yard line. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. First half showed us some pretty good offense. Tie game, we'll see what the second half brings. And it'll be interesting because I think both sides feel pretty good about what their offenses are doing. Gotta wonder what adjustments are being made defensively to try and get a spark and maybe slow down the other side. But here, do you change up anything on this opening drive? Not offensively, you don't. You've got everything going your way. You've probably prepared for maybe some change-ups you might expect. Oh, no. You like what your game plan's showing you. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. The safety, Jamal Adams, able to break that one up. And that's one he's got to be happy to have back. There wasn't a hole open in the zone. You'd have to think on early downs like that first down there, need to be a little bit more careful. Yeah, fortunately for him, got a couple more downs to play with. So line of scrimmage still to 39 on second and 10. Prescott now. Now they go screen. It's complete. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. 12 yards there and a first down. And this should be the final play before the quarter ends. And that is going to do it for this third quarter of action. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. down throw for Prescott. Nowhere to escape and he goes down. Brandon Copeland credit him with a sack as he buries him for a loss of 10. And plays like that really hurt play calling. They had a really nice gain on the previous play but gave about half the yardage back on the sack. Excellent pressure up front. Nowhere to go with the football. Down he goes. And the job becomes twice as difficult now after the sack. It's second and 20. Throwing. Prescott. Going right side. He has Winton. And that's going to be another first down as the tackle made at the Jets' 38-yard line. Tell you what, he's been able to put the ball in some tight spots all game long. That throw, no different. Yeah, a lot of people would call it a gutsy type of a throw. I think he looks at it as... I can do it, so it's not that big of a deal to me, and I'm going to keep firing. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Now Elliott. A 
Now he's tackled a yard short of the marker. Good gain of nine on first down. Again, it's Elliott. Looking for a crease, can't find one. Stopped at the line of scrimmage. He continues to struggle to find a crease to break off a big one and might need to just put that aside and just try and ram his way forward and get what he can. Here we go, third and one. Gut check time on both sides. This is Elliott. And he's able to pick up the first down here before he goes down at the 26. They only get two there, but on third and one, that's all they needed to keep the drive going. of a yard and it'll be second down seems pretty obvious defensively a key was stopping the run game how have they done it so successfully to me it seems that these guys really did a nice job of paying attention during the scouting report meeting and you know brandon when they do those they talk about the top plays that these guys like to run the best runs for the top running back those are what you focus on and want to take away and they've done that pretty successfully in this game They'll try to throw now. Prescott. They'll try and set up the screen. It's complete. And he went nowhere. He'll lose yardage back to the 29. He lost two there. And it's third down. Getting down to the good stuff. All tied with two minutes remaining on EA Sports. in possession of the football here as we get you reset and they're facing a big third down now in this tie ball game now a third down throw but it misses the target incomplete that would have been a tough catch but in this two minute drill those are the ones you really hope your guys come up with yeah you don't want your guy to be able to take the out because it was a tough catch you needed him to come up with that one because if he does it alters the perspective of this two minute drill doesn't it It's short, it's no good, and a costly one there as this game remains tied here in the fourth. What a tough spot to miss a kick, just an absolute letdown. Look, they got themselves in the field goal range, gave them a chance to take the lead, they come up empty, and now you wonder, will their offense ever see the football again? Yeah, because on the other side, run through the post, and this thing could be over. And able to rip off a big chunk of yardage before being dropped inside the 40. 25 yards that time. Now Donald. They'll let this go for the end zone. And is it a touchdown? No signal. No, they say incomplete. Robbie Anderson, the man he was looking for. And that'll bring up second down. Mike, check, check, watch 54, watch 54. Drop deep, drop deep. Stay open, stay open. Mike, 54. Now a draw play. This is Bell. They'll wind up getting 10 back as that sets him up for third down. The offense on third down tonight, they've hit two for four thus far. They're looking at third and a few inches. They'll go again with Bell. And he's going to get the first down as they bring him down at the 23. It's a pickup of six and good enough to move the chains. Okay, there's three timeouts left, right? I think you got to use one here, don't no you? No doubt about it. I'd use one right here. On first down, Bell. 
And down inside the 15, shy of the 10. Now they get the timeout. It leads you to wonder, will they kick it here or risk running another play and possibly not getting down in time? We'll see. They'll run on first down. It's Bell, and able to break one tackle, but then quickly brought down. And they're going to get the timeout call. What a finish. We're down to four seconds to go in this football game. And his kick is in. 